Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Forbidden Recall by Skyfert. I have been meaning to play Skyfert maps for a long time, and I'm way behind, but uh, I will play this one in the meantime. Let's read the description. Recalling the previous test chambers that were condemned, you enter more test chambers that are in disrepair. This map is a sequel to the Forbidden, which I have not played, I think. I don't know. I honestly don't remember which of these maps I've played and which I haven't. Watch out for the goo, ponds, and bottomless pits. Medium difficulty. And one friend has added this to their favorites, namely, Deathwish. Well, let's get going. Ooh, look at this. I don't know if I've seen that with the, the vines, like, directly in your face like that. Also, from this angle, these kind of look like they're at the same distance, but they're not. Cool stuff, let's get going. This is... Suspicious. <laughs> oh, yep, I knew it. Alright, do not enter, huh? Ooh, got that up there. And this is... Woo! Hey! Hang on a second. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even get to check what's over there. I wanna know what's in here. Just eye candy? Alright. I can take just the eye candy. Alright, let's get back out and resolve the puzzle. Oh, well, I was gonna take that with me. Oh, it actually makes a disintegrating sound. Alright. Gel control. Oh, wow. Hello. Interesting, why? Okay, so there's nothing in here but the shell control, so we do need this for something. Wow, at this frame rate. <laughs> you guys are seeing this too, right? At at, at 30 frames a second, uh, these gel blobs just just look like they're a dotted line that's not even really moving. That's cool looking. Alright, what do we want to do? Yeah, look at that. That is... that is trippy. Alright. Was there something in here we could shoot at, or...? No, I don't think so. Alright, what happens if we do this now? Hmm... Yep, that door definitely does not open. Oh, crap. <laughs> oh, do we just want to get over there, perhaps? That might be feasible. With a quick save, that is. <laughs> I didn't jump. That's a bit of an issue. Let's jump this time. Hey, I did it. And I'm not even supposed to be over here. Well, I'm clearly missing something obvious. And <laughs> I'm trapped! Alright, well, let's go back up here. You know, did I have a- have I walked on this area yet? Oh my gosh, I did not even- Wow! That's the obvious thing I'm missing. I'm so sorry. Look at this, this is- Oh wow, we can actually go underwater, will we drown? I wanna see if we'll start drowning. Whoa, what the heck? It's like, momentum is conserved. Like, I'm just sliding here. Oh goodness, this is... Oh goodness, this is hard to control, it's gonna be hard to drown myself. Can I drown myself? I don't know, this is not even the right kind of water for that. All I know is that that's really slippery and weird. 
Okay, what do we want the gel for, though? Like, there's... Ah, here we go. This is something where we can... <laughs> oh, wow! I've never seen that before! Why does it look like that? That's like DNA! It's like the M&Ms and DNA in uh, that one movie about aliens or something. The m M&M, The m ms DNA in some movie. Don't remember the name of it, though. Oh, and it's actually going through the, uh, the back of the funnel. <laughs> that looks interesting. Alright, so... Does this reverse the funnel, or just... Ah, ah! Here's the way I actually want the gel. Maybe. Kinda. Perhaps. Oh, that does reverse the funnel. Alright, okay. There we go. So let's get this funnel loaded up with gel. And then we can do this. There we go. And then we have a cube. Which we can use the funnel to help get out, I believe. Yep. Nope. Oh, <laughs> that was kinda... kinda dumb of me. And I did it again! <laughs> come out, come out wherever you cube. Alright, got the cube out. Let me just, uh, back in here, and do this. Alright, I think that's worth quick saving over. So I think we're gonna be going in there-ish, right? There's also... stuff up there, so yeah, that'll probably just take us up there. Let's try it. Oh, this could've been a cool secret, oh well. Yep, this takes us up here. We've got... a little room in here we can't get into. Can we use the chair to smash the glass? Nope. It appears... not. Alright, let's just use the chair elsewhere then. So... I wonder if this is gonna be a problem or if it'll still be connected. Let's find out. Oh, nope, it's not a problem. Alright, so all we need to do is funnel the cube to its death, right? And that'll allow us to pick it up. Yep. You're coming with me, chair. Hey, it actually disintegrates. Uh-oh. That's not good. Look at that! Hey, I can make that jump! Condemned. We got some gel here, that I don't remember turning on, but we've got it. And... That is mysterious and interesting. Huh. That. Yeah, that's portable. But why would we want to do that? Oh, that's cool when they join up. Look at that, that's a cool pattern. Like, we've got gel there now, but... So what avail? Something in here I missed? There's this over here. <coughs> Excuse me. It's the asbestos from these funnels. Let's see, this looks like an angle panel there, buddy. Oh, okay, let me- let me try this real quick. Ah, yes, that's why this is over here. These little out juttings. 
They're never just there for no reason, they're so that you can angle yourself at something else. That's something I learned in, uh, the Turing test. Alright. Mmm. How does one... What would be the best way to do that? Like, this seems physically designed to prevent us from gaining any height using this. Maybe you just have to run and jump for it? It's worth a shot. <laughs> I thought there was- <laughs> I thought there was railing behind me. No, there is not. There is not railing in that one specific spot. Oh, wow. Look at that! The one spot where there's no railing and I back off the ledge. Oh, what- what just happened there? Oh, and I didn't jump. But I might be able to make that. Oh, you know what? I'm- I feel really dumb right now. I feel dumb now, cause I know the solution. Cause I got gel there, that's where I can- That's where I can bounce from, duh. Let's see... Put that there. Uh... Ish. Put that back there again, and then we'll... There we go. There we go, that's how you do it. This is... Sparky. Ah, that was relevant. Are we gonna need to get gel in here? Is the question. Okay, so there is a way to get back up. I do want to investigate. Interesting. Yeah, it looks like we can just funnel ourselves over there, so let's, let's, uh... Let's get ourselves back up. And... Let's see, take the funnel. And then we funnel ourselves. Ah, oh, but we need the gel. Okay. We'll do... Yeah, that's fine. We'll do that, and then... Oh, right, there's glass there. Hmm. Alright. Nope, not a problem. Go back, get the gel there, and... yeah. Yeah, this should be able to get us high enough. Yep, definitely. Then we go back here, and because it's a cleverly designed puzzle, we don't have to redo this part again. We'll take this, and we will go there. Ta-da! Alright, let's get this over with. Oh, goodness! Whoa, why is it shooting fire at me? Oh, and the funnel turned off. I probably should not speed things up in a hammer map, because you never know when stuff like that's gonna happen. Ooh, I love the shadows. Let's see... Where might we be interested in traveling to? Ah, here we go. Arrow up there. So I guess this is all just eye candy? Seems like it. Ooh, that's tantalizing. Wow, that... that sound... That's a bit of an awkward transition for the sound there. Might want to adjust that. So we want to go up there, right? Oops. Not yet. How did I mess that up? I shut the wrong portal, apparently. Alright. 
There we go, that time I did the correct portals. So we're up here now. Do we just need the more height for this guy? Perhaps? Let's find out. Oh, goodness. Hey, that worked. I thought I was gonna hit the fan. Look at this, this reminds me of Portal 1. Nice, I really like that. And then... Let me guess. Like that, I assume? Yeah, because we don't need as much distance. There we go. We've got a tube, which seems like our only option, but... Oh, we can't pick up the chair! That's sad. The chair's fallen over, and Chell's too sad about it to pick it up. At least I think we're playing as Chell. Are we playing as Bindi? I didn't actually look. Let's find out. Nope, we're playing as Bindi. Alright. This is a song I like. Alright. Got an actual puzzle. Not to say that everything else we did wasn't a puzzle, I mean, it's just more of a traditional looking puzzle. So let's get our bearings. This is a cube. The laser. That is precariously balanced. Some broken looking glass that I feel like I can almost shoot through. There is a platform here. A very suspicious platform. Might be for making sure you don't get trapped and have to die. Ah. Alright, well. Let's just do the obvious thing. Let's see if the naive approach works. Disables that fizzler temporarily. A bit longer than I was expecting. I guess maybe we were supposed to walk through it during that time? Oh, look at this. That's not it, is it? Surely not. There's stuff over there, though. These things, I want to see them. Can't get in here, I guess. It's purely eye candy. Alright, well, are we really supposed to just go there? I guess let's find out. Will this door just open? Oh, it does! Okay. Not what I was expecting. Conversion gel used to be there, apparently. Can't break that. There's this path, and this path. But I'm assuming we'll be going in both directions anyway. This looks like a spot for a funnel. Alright, let's head downstairs. Oh, it's a spot for a light bridge. That works too. Looks like we're gonna have conversion gel next. All three gels in one map. As separate puzzles, that is. Test subject waiting area. Condemned. Lots of cool eye candy. Ooh! 
don't think I've seen or heard a door make that noise. Okay, well that's portable, so is this- yeah, here we go. Can I take the chair? Nope, this one is also making Shell too sad to pick it up. <laughs> what? How- Why did those pieces fall in unison? That does not make it- They're not even attached! Sky ferrets! <laughs> Look at this. We can totally fit through here. Of course, I say that in every map that uses these things. This is... interesting. Oh, but we can't even shoot through there. Alright, fair enough. So that reverses the funnel. There's a glowing X here, for where we need to put the funnel to push a cube up. And then we've got... more stuff over here, I suppose? Ah, we actually need a cube here. Alright. What do we have in here? Is this the room where we activate the conversion gel? Oh no, this is just... This is just eye candy, alright. I guess, is that also just eye candy? I don't see a way to get in there. Unless they- unless there's some way to smash a window and shoot a portal in. That looks interesting. Alright, so this'll disable the, f the field, right? And then we can just do that and launch the cube across, I'm assuming. Alright, so let's get ourselves a cube, to start out with. This... why does that look... What the heck is going on here? That does not look right! Uh... something is definitely broken with the layering here. That is bizarre. Alright. Needs a little bit of fixing up, it seems. Surely not. SURELY NOT! Alright. So, step one. Do this. Of course, we could just lift it up with the funnel, and that works too. Alright, so then... We use this... To reverse it. Then we do that. And then that. <laughs> the way it landed, it was just like, it just stopped. Guess that's just like Andy. Is this really the end? I guess so. I- we didn't use conversion gel though. I thought we were. Oh well. Maybe in the next map. Alright, as always, thank you for watching. If you hate the sound of my voice, leave a dislike, it's up to you. I will see you all in the next episode. Goodbye!